Morphomatic, Diomatic's enhanced morphing modifier for 3DS Max, has been used in countless productions over the years, by leading production studios and freelance 3D artists alike. Typically, studios and freelancers end up creating custom tools for the morpher modifier to suit the project they are working on at the time. Luis San Juan of Nexus Productions once stated Morphomatic as the tool for animating with morph targets in 3DS Max. Morphomatic is like a supercharged morpher modifier with a lot of the most commonly requested features and still fully scriptable using the MaxScript language. So if you want to access a certain channel, for example, you can use simple MaxScript commands to do so. So if you want to access the first channel, you can access this by typing 1 between brackets. And in this case, we want to access the progressive value of that same first channel, which is the second parameter. To do so, on the same line, type 2 between brackets. And just by doing this, we have access to the mouth open morph channel that we see here. So if I want to change the value, I can just type in value, and immediately the current value is displayed. I can see that the value is currently zero, and if I change it by typing the new value after an equal sign, let's say 50, the value is updated. So, Accessing Morphomatic via MaxScript is very easy. If you want to go beyond editing some of the values, you can also access most of the features this way. To see the list of commands supported by Morphomatic in MaxScript, you can go to Documentation, then in Reference Guide, and then in MaxScript Reference. In this section is a complete list of all MaxScript commands that are available. Thank you for watching this quick overview on how to use MaxScript to control Morphomatic. For more information and trials of Morphomatic and other time-saving Diomatic software and plugins, go to www.diomatic.com.